Now this here is going to be the alternative lid to the container. You're going to do the folds the same. So let's start out by bisecting the eye. Now remember this is the alternative lid. Bisect the eye here. Now we're going to fold it in half. Now we want to fold it into thirds and fold it the best way you know how. I myself by making the S is the best method for dividing the bill up into thirds. All right. Now, since we're making a lid, we're going to fold the bottom up. So underneath the one, we're going to fold it all the way across. And if you want, underneath the one, runs right above one dollar here and ends up under the one here. So you can follow the dollar and the one all the way to the bottom of the other one. You got that folded you're going to do a second fold right up underneath where this edge meets the dollar all right give her a nice crease now what you want to do is turn your dollar this way with the fold facing you and we're going to exercise all these folds here where you divided the dollar in threes. So now you should have six sections. One, two, three, four, five, six. And this is going to be an overlapping. So this one is going to overlap, but you want six sections. One, two, three, four, five, six. And this one is going to overlap. Or should I say you're going to tuck it underneath. But anyhow, all those folds... We're going to exercise those folds to be mountain folds. So just go down the bill just like so. Okay, now I kind of want to open her back up a little bit. Now, from this corner to the top of this edge, you want to do a diagonal valley fold. So, it's going to be something like this. And we want to do that all the way down the bill. Only from the corner to this top corner, diagonal valley fold.
Now since this one is not as the same length as these folds here, go ahead and wrap it. And remember, this one is going to be tucked in. So what you want to do is, you see this crease here? Go ahead and grab both sides and give that second, the second one a crease so you can know where to fold it. And see, it doesn't quite go to the corner because it's not a full section. Okay. Now, when connecting these, you want to tuck this end inside of this end. So, that's going to be something like this here. be a little tight so you just got to work with it a little bit okay now, you're going to do this just like the bottom section. And I have a link down there to the other one. If you haven't made it yet, or I might just make the bottom again for you guys who haven't made it before. But I'm starting out with the lid because this is the alternative lid. Now, start where the dollar meets. You want to pinch and twist pinch and twist pinch and twist pinch and twist and it all will lay down flat then eventually you have a lid that's like your bottom okay and that is the alternative lid for your container. Have there, and you can put anything inside these you want. But like I said, I had the folds going the same way. And there is your box. And there's the Ngawi Trust facing out. You can put more money aside there silver dollars simply leave it on the table like that as a tip and there you go thanks for watching